Hi, my name is Cassie Ho and I'm from San Francisco, California. I am a certified Pilates and fitness instructor. Basically, I took my workouts online, so now I'm a YouTuber turned healthy living blogger. Oh, and I also design yoga bags and gym bags. I was moving from California to Boston and it was right out of college and had been teaching a group of students out in LA for a while and I told them, oh guys, I have to go and they were like, oh my God, we're gonna miss you so much. And so I decided, well, the only way they can continue working out with me is to put up a video. So, and then all of a sudden I got all these comments and then people wanted to you know, me to make more videos. I'm like, what? what is this? I don't understand YouTube. And then around the same time, um, I think nine months into my corporate job, I hated it so much. Um, and one of my yoga bags got in Shape Magazine. And I decided, you know, I'm gonna quit my job. I'm gonna go full force into the bag thing. And so once I did that, I had a little bit more time to blog and make videos. And because of that, I had more time to write and things. And then everything just started to grow. This is my first time in the UK, no, in Europe, actually. I'm here for the 2012 Olympics. I'm going on behalf of YouTube, so they sent over, um, I think about 30 channels over here just to explore the city, to experience the games, and so I'm just here to make some workout videos on awesome backdrops. When I make my videos, I really hope that my students, from wherever they're coming from, really become self-motivated to work out themselves. You know, not just work out to my videos, but take those moves and teach it to their friends and just really build a healthy lifestyle. I never expected there to be a Blogilates community. And I just can't believe that people, um, they really appreciate that. And that I think really drives the community, that cycle, that very infectious, positive cycle of wanting to continuously give and give and give. And it comes from both sides too. And I think that's why the community has grown so much because we both, on both sides, genuinely want to work together. Pop Pilates is basically Pilates to pop music. That's exactly what it is and that's how it started. Basically, it's like a rhythmic Pilates where you pulse to the beat because that way you don't think about counting. You don't really have to think about breath because you're just breathing with the pulses. It, it's just become so much more fluid, a lot more fun and a little bit more fast paced. There are so many exercises that it's gonna be really hard for me and every time I do a video, I always tell them, this is my favorite exercise. This one's my favorite exercise. And I think everything is my favorite exercise. A superstar move that I always, always love is the candlestick dipper. And basically it attacks your obliques like none other. It is so good and really stretches it out. That one's amazing to get on both sides. It really whittles down the, uh, the core, the, the waist. For but I really like the grasshopper. The grasshopper allows you to clench your butt cheeks together and just lift, 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 and those little pulses really round out the butt, really tone it up and lift it up, which is awesome. For arms, I would have to say I love elbow push-ups. Um, basically, it attacks your chest, your shoulders, your upper back, and your core all at the same time, along with arms, of course, and so that's a total body move. Favorite exercise for legs, I'm gonna go ahead and go with inner thigh, because all women are, for whatever reason, so obsessed with that. And here in Froggers, what you do is you keep your heels together and you just reach out and extend the legs. And that action of bringing your, um, your knees together really attacks those inner thighs so well. So you gotta pretend like there is a pillow or something, you gotta clench right in between your knees as you extend, that's really gonna attack it. I really just want people to connect with each other off screen too. I want it to become like a fitness friendship, if that makes any sense. I never want the blog of Pilates community to stop growing because I really believe that when you put your heart and you give yourself a chance to succeed, you really, really can.